Hi and welcome to the Azam Sharp channel on YouTube. I'm your host Mohammad Azam with another screencast. Now in this screencast I'd like to show you that how you can create a framework type project and also link that framework project into some other different kind of a project. All right. So let's first let's go start our framework project. Now if you are wondering why would you create a framework project a framework project is basically acts as a framework, just like any other framework that you add into your iPhone application. So if you're adding a core location, if you're adding a, a UI kit, all of those are actually frameworks and they contain a lot of different libraries. So if you're adding a UI kit, you will get access to a text field, a button, and so many different things. So just like that, um, if you create your own framework project, you can embed different controls, different uh, libraries into it, different features, different APIs into it. So anyone who wants to use those APIs will simply use the framework instead of downloading uh, and adding multiple files into their project. So start with your project. I'm going to select framework and library and Cocoa Touch framework. Now I'm going to call this AZ framework. All right, and I'm going to create that. Now I already have another, so let me go ahead and start another one also. New, uh, well, let's see this one. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy some controls that I want to use. So I'm going to copy, oops. Yeah, I'm just going to copy from the other window a stepper view control. Make sure that copy items if needed is checked. And I'm also going to copy switch view. There we go. Okay. Now in the azframework.header file, I'm going to add all the different header files that I want this uh, basically framework to process. Or make it available to the other parties. So I'm going to say AV framework slash stepper view dot h. And pretty much the same way, I'm going to use a switch view dot h. Okay. Now, one other thing that you have to do is by default, you will see that the stepper view and the switch view are basically not part of the public header. Now, in order for the other projects to see these controls or to use these features, they have to be part of the public header. So I'm just gonna move it into the public header like that. Go ahead and build your application and that's it, all right? Um, now I can create a new project which will be a single view application. I'm just going to name it Pet Store. This will be the application that is actually going to consume the framework that you just built. But at this point we don't really know where the framework is so I'm just going to select the framework and I'm going to say show in finder. And this is the position, this is the location of the framework. You go ahead and move this one. So basically what I'm going to do is I am going to drag the framework into my pet store project. I'm going to say finish. All right. Now a couple of things I need to set. First I'm going to go to build phases and see that everything is added over here. You can see the AZ framework is actually added over here. But if you go to general phases you will see that embedded binaries is actually blank. So I'm just going to add the AV framework into embedded binaries. It adds a duplicate entry into link frameworks. I can add, remove one of those. Let's go ahead and build the application. Okay. I'm going to open the view controller.h. So now it's time to actually use the framework. So I'm going to say import, um, the name is AV framework slash AZ framework dot H. Okay, now I can go to my view controller 
and I can start making the controls that are part of the AV framework. So I'm going to say switch view alloc oops init with frame cg rectangle make uh, 0 comma 0 100 comma 100 and I can let simply add self dot view add sub view switch view all right let's go ahead and run it so that we can see our control in action the switch view control okay here we go and there it is our switch view control isn't that awesome and I can turn it on turn it off it's a simple switch view control that we built which is part of the AV framework so instead of adding multiple files multiple directories and all of that stuff we just have added the AV framework dot framework basically we have added a framework to our project and that gives us the ability to use all the features that it provides and that is how you add a framework to your project thank you very much